I'd like to do an in-depth demo of the IntelliGant web part for Project 2010 and how it can share multiple plans to multiple lists and then aggregate them in a master sub-project plan to a separate SharePoint list. So bear with me, it's a bit involved, but we'll start out by sharing this simple project plan. And we'll put this onto a SharePoint 2007 site. And we'll double click for a quick updates. See the information populate and the project's now shared. Take a look at it here. And we can go into one of these folders and see the uh, sub subtasks. And now we'll do the same thing with another project, Project 2. It's the same plan, it's just moved into the future a bit. And we'll share this one to a SharePoint 2010 site. Double click for quick populate. Hyperlinks are there, and so let's take a look. And sure enough, here are our tasks. So finally, we will create a master project and insert Project 1, Project 2 into the master and send all that data uh, in aggregate to another SharePoint site. Uh, so we'll go to Project, insert Project 1, insert Subproject 2, and we will show the project summary task that will be our data source route. And then finally, a very important step. Uh, we have been saving data, uh, SharePoint connection data, in text 11. We're going to change that to text 10. And this is where we'll store our connection data uh, within the master. So again, go to our aggregate, connect to the site. And the project plan is populating. Let's check out the aggregate homepage. We've got our handy IntelliGant web part, which is nice because it'll show you uh, both plans in their entirety, including the children and the links. And here are two projects together at a top level.